Hey, my legion. How y'all doing today? I'm here with my buddy John, and we want to see, uh, hear a review of movie Black Widow, which got pushed back for about a year because of the COVID and stuff. Right. Yeah, well, actually, it got pushed back even further because originally Kevin Feige wanted to do, I think, a Black Widow movie when he was doing all the errors, but one of the people above his head thought, well, no one wants to see a, a movie with a female hero. Yeah, a female hero. It's like, uh, yeah. But, yeah, Kevin always wanted to do something from the start. Of course, Hawks County never got his due either, but, uh... But Wonder Woman did great at the yeah. theater. The first one... That's why the they finally decided, oh, I guess we should do one. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I, I I like, I mean... It did a really good job. It was a great cast, because he had, uh, you know, Scarlet, and you had Florence Pook from, uh, Wrestling With My Family. Yeah. Or how he's here in Leslie. Yeah. And, um, Midsummer. And then uh, you have Rachel Weisz from uh, uh, Enemy at the Gate, and of course David Harbour yeah. from uh, Stranger Things. Stranger Things, and then you have uh, Ray Winston, I believe his name was, who was <coughs> in Black Sail, and he was a yeah. Punisher after. Um, oh, what's his name? <coughs> See, I'd never seen that Punisher. That yeah, was the guy who Punisher War Zone. Yeah, Punisher War Zone. Yeah. I can't That's remember who done the, the original one. No. Thomas Jean. Well, the original one was Dolph Lundgren, but yeah. that was... So, yeah, they had a great cast to it. And uh, it takes place during, right after, no, is it right before Civil War, I believe. Yeah. Maybe, something like that. Yeah. And it's like she goes back and to her uh, kind of family roots and yeah. get a little bit more background of her character and stuff. Yeah, I thought it was pretty good. I liked it, and it really funny and stuff. Uh, yeah, David Harbour steals. Uh, yeah, well, I mean, whenever they, uh, you know, he's in there for a little bit, and then he kind of disappears, and then when he, they have the thing when they, he's in prison. That, I mean, it was really good and interesting before, but I think it takes off a little bit more whenever he right. is in prison and break him. And yeah, it's a lot of fun. I give it a, I give it an eight out of ten. I really enjoyed it. And then right. there's at the end of the, there's not a mid credit scene but there's a, a big like three four minute scene at the very end of the movie right but I, I enjoyed the movie it was a lot of fun oh yeah it did a very good job and, yeah. yeah they did really good with it oh, there's a ocean background which is pretty cool ocean no, i mean not the ocean aquarium background for the <laughs> roku and stuff I'm like wow it changed <laughs> yeah no but i really liked it so oh, I, yeah. I guess that's it for me our review of uh uh the <laughs> the mass spoofer. No, a review of uh, Black Widow. So until I, uh, until then, everybody, please take care of my legion.